Xander, Zayus, what's good, Xander? Everything's good. I mean, just, just finished with the wings, now I'm ready to go eat. All right, um, just moved up from 147 to 154. How does your body feel? My body feels amazing. I mean, uh, I get to eat more during camp. It's less, it's less weight that I got to cut, so I feel, I feel good. I feel amazing, big, and just ready to put on a show. Hey, bro, I'm looking at you. I don't know how you ever made 147, yo. Man, uh, it, it, was, it wasn't difficult when at the beginning. Then once it started to get a little difficult, we made, we made the adjustments. We, we sat down as a team. And we, you know, we said that it, it was time to move up. All right, um, yeah, really good power at 47. Like, how, how does your body feel at 54? Do you feel stronger, faster, what? It was amazing. At um, uh, 47, at uh, 47, I feel, I feel good. Now at uh, 54, I feel stronger. I feel sharper. I feel bigger. And again, I'm just, I'm just ready to put on the show tomorrow night. All right, um, Dan Carpenter, he's a veteran. Um, what can he do to make this a difficult fight? Man, well, he's never been knocked down. Um, he's never been down or out in a fight. Um, he's very experienced. He's coming to fight. He's very, he's very crafty. But again, I, I, I will make all the adjustments necessary to, to get out with a victory tomorrow night. Did you, did you pick him as an opponent because he's never been knocked down, because he's sturdy, and you want to be the first guy to put him out? Um, man, um, they, gave us, they gave us a couple of opponents. And that was, that was the one that stood out for me. Um, it was a guy that had experience. It was a guy that comes from a boxing family. And, and overall, I think he's the one that is, it was going to give me the better fight. Okay. Now, you're a big puncher, like I said. Do you look for the knockout or do you just let it come naturally? No, the knockout, I, I never look for the knockout. The knockout comes to me. That's, that's what I believe personally. Um, but I just, I just have to stay focused, listen to my corner, and do what I do, do all the adjustments they tell me to do to come out victorious. Puerto Rico has a long lineage of great fighters. Is there any pressure that people consider you the next great Puerto Rican fighter? No, not at all. No pressure. Um, I mean, it's just a responsibility. I just have to stay focused, keep listening to my corner, and keep doing what I love. What can we expect from tomorrow night's performance? Man, tomorrow night, don't miss it on ESPN. I will put on a show, and I will show the Atlanta crowd that you know the Puerto Rican Puerto, Puerto Rico is coming and uh, that we got a lot of fighters coming up. Oh, uh, thanks, Xander. Thank I appreciate you. you, man. Thank you.